What do we talk about the decision? Obviously, you, you didn't have to wait to signing day. You, you kind of knew it this week. Talk about that process. Um, it was an easy decision. I sat down with my family. Um, we talked about the tough decision. They didn't want to make it easy for me. It wasn't an easy decision. You know, um, schools like TCU that recruited me, they recruited me really hard. But, um, you know, it was eight, nine hours away. Um, Chris Shag Glasgow did a good job of recruiting from TCU. You know, I have a lot of respect for that good staff. And um, when I called them and told them that I was going to um, commit to them, they were like, we don't care where you go to school at. We love you. Anything you need. We'll be here for you, no matter no matter what the decision may be. But it wasn't an easy decision. Um, you know, we had a talk last week. My family it was pretty emotional. It's a tough decision that I made. So, so how close was TCU to LSU in this process? It was really close. It was about what and what until I thought about it, and um, it was um it was a tough decision. How, how much did this, this official visit to LSU last week kind of make the difference for you? Um, you know, I've been there numerous times, but the official visit really didn't make a really didn't make or break my decision. Um, what, what, what was it at the end of the day that made you come down? And, you know, made you decide LSU? I mean, what? The tone, the tone. So I felt comfortable there, four or five minutes away from home. And, um, I just felt like it was the right decision. How does it feel to have this over with? Oh, it, oh it, 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 it feels unbelievable. I can actually enjoy my senior year now. And, um, just, just enjoy the rest of high school. How stressful is this whole process, man? I mean, oh, it was, it, it was fun in the beginning, but at the end, you know, getting phone calls every night. I'm happy. So, what uh, what are your expectations going in? I mean, how soon do you think you can play? Um, I plan on going and playing the street freshman, but if I have to rush it, I'll rush it. But um, I just want to work hard this summer and every summer, so just to get better. Does the fact that LSU is losing its two tackles from last year kind of give you some confidence that you have a, you at least have a shot to kind of earn playing time if you do well this spring? Yes, sir. No, well, I won't. I Not won't spring, until in, the in June. Yeah. Um, that gives me a lot of confidence, but you have to compete wherever you go. So I just want to get there and compete. What was it like when you called Coach Miles a couple minutes ago um, with, with JT, and, and what was that experience like? Uh, he, Coach Miles was happy. He <laughs> said I'm the missing piece to the puzzle, so it's finally complete now. So, what, what? How does it feel to, to hear that from your future coach? You know, like that you're the future piece of the puzzle. I mean, that, that's a, that's a high good. praise. It's a good feeling, but you know, I just have to get there and work hard. Nothing's going to be given to me. So. Um, some of the other schools that are in, in contention for you, schools like Georgia and Miami, what, why did they end up falling out of contention? All of them are good schools. Um, I have nothing bad to say about them. I was um, thankful for them recruiting me over the years, but I wish you was home. What about, uh, I know at the Under Armour game, uh, Mike and Dre were really coming after you pretty hard, trying to get you to commit then. Uh, you know, have you heard from those guys a lot lately? Yeah, I have. Um, you know, Mike DeVon and he enrolled early. Guys like that, they all enrolled early. I'm not uh, in early enrolling, but, um, you know, they seem to be enjoying it. Um, we just going to get that and work hard. That's all we can do, just work hard. The recruiting process is over now. The stars don't need anything. Just got to get there and work hard. And I know Ole Miss was really, really coming hard for you. Uh, was it hard to turn them down? Well, they actually dropped on me. Um, so, because all the tackle spots were filled, so they contacted me last week and told me, so. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I know that you had planned to visit either Auburn or Ole Miss, you know, sometime this month still. Um, how did it feel that they, that they dropped you once they filled the ta tackle spots? Mm, I didn't have a problem with did it. it. Did it make your decision actually easier? Yeah, it made it actually <laughs> easier, so. So they called you last week? No, Coach Hurricane by last week and told me, so. Told me, told me that they would yeah. What? Uh, when did you know you had a chance to be a highly recruited player? I mean, like, where in your career did you? I had no idea. I just did whatever Coach Jerry told me to do. You know, just work hard during the summers. You know, just, just improve every year. Thanks, Willie.